Well, it's a little bit of a different one today. I'm working on my car because I've got a water leak. So, up in here, this is inside the air duct of my car. You can see there's a clip up there. Hopefully you can see it. Try to get to focus on it. It's not the best positioning. And, um, well, I pulled this, that's where the motor normally goes, my fan. Alright, uh, here's the fan, taken out. And it's all behind all this console just in here. Now the, um, I get the thing to focus again, there we go. Um, and so I've been getting water leaks, I've noticed that the past couple of months, I think since it started raining, um, I'm getting a lot of condensation in the car, so I found that the, um, I find the, the carpet was all wet and everything, and uh, I've been drying it out. But I noticed I'm still getting water coming in. I've resealed around the windscreen, and uh, it's still leaking. I did have a leak above the windscreen, which I fixed because the windscreen was replaced earlier in the year and they stuffed it up, it would seem. And the clip, which you could see just now, um, is leaking. So hold on a second. So on the top of the car here. That's the clip just there, and I'm trying to get that out. Um, and there's also a clip just here. You can't can't really see, but that was actually broken. It was all smashed, um, which holds the the panel in, which goes across the, the front right here. So um, that I need to do in too. So that's been great fun. So I've got to try and get this clip out, so I can um, clean it all up and stick some silicon sealant or something. I should put an automotive like sitting around it so it doesn't leak anymore and hopefully I should fix that problem all right so I managed to get the clip out and here it is um, you see it's all a bit stuffed and what is this fine washers I use they gradually, gradually get old I mean this car's uh, what is it 14 years old something like now so yeah anyway it's a good car that just this so I can also see here that it's got some rusting going on it's not really smooth there, so what I'm going to have to do here is um, sand all this off, clean that rust up, fix that. And uh, whether that started before it started leaking or as a result of the leaking, I'm not quite sure. But um, So I'm going to have to fix all that up as well. Okay, so we go, I've cleaned up a little bit. So, uh, see I've sanded that back. There's no rust on this bit, so I'm really worried about that. But I've taken all this rust off here, get it into focus. You can see there's a little bit of residue there. So I'm going to do some rust treatment on this and then I'm going to paint it and then uh, use that sealant and put it all back together again. I've also done the inside as well, reached up inside and, and sanded the inside as well. I have to make sure I spread the rust treatment around the inside so it doesn't rust from the inside out. But uh, yeah, a bit of a pain, but okay. All right, so there we go, all back together again and uh, ready to try out. We'll see if that uh, ends up fixing it or not. The, uh, Strip along the top here, which got pulled out by the windscreen guy. Um, hasn't gone back in again. I'm trying to figure out why they unclipped back in. I'm not sure why that is. <laughs> 